climbing, hang gliding, a playground, and we're going to keep the petting zoo that we already have, um, an educational center, and a campsite. All right. Diagram of it, obviously, open spaces around us. Now, you're going to be able to have hang gliding, horseback riding, petting <laughs> zoo. We're going to try and get an agreement with open space to let our customers go into their territory. Of course, that's going to a waiver saying if anything happens. Um, to get more room to bike ride or just do this stuff, whatever they really want. Alright, so we plan to have a grazing system to prevent forest fires and also to employ local ranchers to help keep the cowboy life alive, right? <laughs> um, we know that that's an important part of the Hackman Bay community. And we also would need a tenant to come and help us with fences. And throughout the grazing pastures, there will be biking and hiking and riding trails out there. But one thing that we will have that other parts do not have is that we will inform the public which pasture the cattle will be grazing. So we know that some people are a little afraid, you know, don't want to be getting too close, especially if they have dogs. So they will be able to choose what pasture they're in and therefore stay clear of the cows if need be. And then along with that, we have um, grasslands and shrubland. We have a lot of coyote bush up in the hills that needs to be brought down to a much lower level, which will also help prevent fire hazard. So we plan on bringing in a bunch of goats to help crush the coyote bush. And then with rotational grazing throughout the different pastures, we will have a more sustainable and safe Elkins Ranch. Um, so things that need to happen for our camp to be complete or happen is find a cattle tenant first so that we can get um, troughs put in so that they are, the cattle have stuff to drink. Um, get goats to push down the overgrowth of sagebrush. Make roads safe and accessible for all vehicles and put in roads to the hang gliding perch and zip line for when we put them in the near future. Um, for how the road's just one lane, it's kind of hard because I know when we were using the vans, we didn't know if someone else was coming down, so we couldn't really figure it out without talking on the radios, and so you wouldn't know if someone else was coming, so we really want to make that two lanes instead of one. Um, we also need the tenant to put in new fencing, water troughs, and gates. We want to clear out a campsite and parking, put in a children's playground, put in all the materials needed for the education center. And for the tenant that would be, um, we would be running the ground out for, we want to make his pay for the first few months or however long it takes for the fencing and the troughs just to be doing that instead of him having to actually pay us for it. So that he would be paying us and fixing all of that stuff instead of actual money. Right. And the reason we should be ours is we're making a tourist attraction. And on my way in, I saw lots of tree farms, gardens, brings money into the area. You can get someone to go buy one of those giant dinosaurs. <laughs> so watch the driver of the T-Rex truck. <laughs> <laughs> okay. All right. Thank you for your time. Now, according to the rules of the town council, the town council members have the opportunity to ask you questions. Unfortunately, none of the audience are able to participate at this time. However, there will be a write in email session after town council meeting can participate in. Um, so the town council members may, may ask you one or several different questions, in which they will ask you to come up with the best answers that you can. So I have a question related to the budget. Do you have a budget that shows how much? Uh, income or not income this will generate, but also how much it's going to cost to develop these trails and especially the road, changing it from a one lane road to a two lane road, any engineering that would need to be done. Do you have a budget? 
We do not have a set budget yet because we also need to find a tenant first and we want to present our, uh, our project and what we think should happen to Elkins Ranch before we set a budget because we also need to have the tenant input and what he thinks. And trails throughout the hills and stuff, that's also something that the cattle do. You see a lot of people in other parts running on cattle trails and they seem perfectly okay with that, especially since it is a pretty hilly place we won't be able to put in many roads. And then along the lines of a new road, I think that even if the Elkins Ranch was not to become a park, it needs a doubling road no matter what. So I think that that's a necessary thing we need to do. Oh, okay. <laughs> What about the purple uh, horse you have? Are you going to have those of us? <laughs> yeah, that's what we're going to have. Awesome things, like whatever it is. Yeah. Awesome things. Yeah. You know, that's part of the playground, actually. The children can go and draw chalk on the white horse and make their name small. Okay. Yeah. Yeah. Kid productivity to do. I did a home for that. Why are you going to play I'm glad you have the map up. This is very helpful. Your earlier list showed a number of very creative ideas that you would like to have happen on the new Elkis Park and Recreation Area. Can you tell me how and where you'll have the zip line? Well, the zip line, the zip line's right here. Okay. So the zip line will be up in the tree area, along with the hang lighting perch. will actually be at the very edge of the property, so you can go down and through the valley that we have here. And what about where they land? And then the hang light, that's all. it's up to the it's up to the person. Do they want to hang light all the way down to the beach? They want to hang light all the way down to the parking lot? It's completely up to them. So you want to be really marketable. Yeah. Okay. So you yes. thought about it. Yes. You know, a lot of things going on and a lot of people moving very fast. I just wondered how they're all going to avoid the <laughs> when they get there. They might merge. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, wow. wow. 